every day, one billion people in the world live without electricity. That number increases when there's a natural disaster, like the one we recently hit uh, that hit Puerto Rico, where it affects over a million people in Puerto Rico. Um, we were just there about uh, a month ago, and they are still suffering from um, living without electricity. Hi, my name is Sean Lundgrath. I'm the CEO of Energy Solar, and our mission is to provide the world with affordable, portable, renewable power. We've won a lot of awards. Uh, awards. We actually won the uh, the um, uh, E Star competition last September here as the number one uh, company. But we've won a lot of awards. We won the Clean Tech Open, which is the largest and oldest clean tech accelerator in the United States. So we've uh, we have a lot of momentum. And what do we do? We don't make the car. We make that portable system that you can take with your car anywhere off the grid. This is a very big market that we're going after. Um, the most obvious market is actually adding a battery backup system to people that already have solar panels on their home. A dirty secret uh, in the solar industry is if the grid goes down, if P&E &E goes down, even though you have solar panels, it won't work. You need a battery backup system. The other opportunity that is a green field that we're going after that no one is going after is the multi-unit uh, dwelling opportunity. These uh, 3 billion and 5 billion, that's just the US. Just imagine if we went to China. People who live in apartments now can actually have a portable solar system like that, that when the power goes down, they have a system that can power their washer. They can do three loads of laundry. They can power their freezer for over 30 hours. They can power 20 laptops or 100 iPhones. That's what our system does. Basically, we built this system, and we actually um, we have a team that, that actually took it to market. We pre-sold it on uh, crowdfunding and pre-sold it for $750,000 worth. Um, that's the team, my background uh, with Apple, a lot of startups, solar industry. Our CTO uh, was the, the guy that, that actually designed the, the Motorola flip phone. So he knows how to miniaturize e electronics. This is our revenue history. We're post-revenue. We actually built our first product and we put it to market and we're selling it like crazy. Uh, we did 1.1 million in 2016. In 2017, we actually almost tripled that. Um, as, as an update, Q1 of 2018, 1.2 million. So we actually exceeded 2016's revenue. What we're doing now is we're actually raising money to launch the next version of our product. It's a couple of show and tells. One of the key technologies is a microgrid software that we're licensing from the Idaho National Lab. We also built our own inverter. This is a three kilowatt inverter. Normally it, it would weigh 60 pounds and be like this big, but we designed this from the, scrap, from the ground up. This is five pounds, three kilowatts. We built our own charge controller from the ground up. None of this was designed by anyone outside of our company, so we know how to do power electronics. That's our uh, core competency. Um, we also have built a cloud infrastructure that goes with that. So basically we're raising uh, we are raising $4 million to take these products to market. All right, judges' comments. Thank you, Sean. Yeah. Hi, do you have any IP here that can protect your innovation? Yes. The, the, the four technologies, yeah. that's either exclusive licenses or exclusive IP that we developed. So the charge controller is all us we designed, that's, that's patent pending. Our uh, nano grid software, we're actually licensing it from the Idaho National Lab and then we're actually putting our secret sauce on top of that, that's our IP. Um, and our cloud infrastructure is actually built from us. Can you talk about competition? Uh, competition wise, um, our main competition is actually solutions like Tesla Powerwall and LG power banks. Those systems are just batteries on the wall. Our system is all in one. It has built-in inverters, charge controller, power management, and it's portable because we built it to be portable. So when the floods come or the fires come, you can take your system and take it to another place. Whereas the Tesla Powerwall, it's bolted to the wall. You can't take it with you. We, we actually don't care about the solar panels. We actually, our charge controller 
can actually take dual source so we could actually do solar panels and, and wind turbines or hydro turbines at the same time. So you can be charging 24 seven. Yeah, so we're, we're not panel. We're, we're, we're all about power electronics. We don't, yeah. Where is your sweet spot for tried and successful customers? And where is your weak spot for tried and failed customers? So our sweet spot is emergency preparedness, people who care about being prepared for natural disasters. Our current weak spot now, because our current system in the market is not big enough to power a whole home. That's why we're building uh, the next generation where we actually, you can actually uh, combine two panels, uh, two inverters together to make a six kilowatt split phase inverter. So it'll run your washer and your dryer. Right now, this thing can't run the dryer. It can only run the washer. So the immediate customer is home, right? Yes, home.